excretion. Living beings take food, water and air. When food digests, some waste materials are produced. It is called feces and is thrown out through anus. Throwing out waste material is called excretion. Plants do not have much waste. They give out carbon dioxide and excess of water through stomata. Reproduction The process of producing its own kind is called reproduction. Animals reproduce in different ways. Animals like fish, birds and reptiles lay eggs. Mammals like rats, cats, cows, elephants, lions, tigers and human beings give birth to young ones, babies. Babies look like their parents. Some animals produce only one baby at a time. Some animals produce many. A mouse can produce as many as 32 young ones at a time. Plants produce seeds. Seeds germinate and grow into full plants. Plants like potato, sugarcane, etc. produce new plants from buds of branches or stems. Non-flowering plants reproduce through spores. Let us learn about the reproduction in plants in detail in the next unit. Let's revise the important points. 1. Growth, feeding, movement, breathing, response to stimuli, excretion and reproduction are called the vital life activities. 2. If a branch of a tree is broken or damaged, new branch grows in its place. This is called regeneration. 3. Some plants like Rafflesia depend on the food made by other plants. These are called parasites. 4. Oxygen that is breathed in breaks down the absorbed food and releases energy for life activities. 5. Anything that causes a response in a living being is called stimulus. Reaction of a living being to a stimulus is called response. Do these. 1. Answer the following questions. Conceptual Understanding 1. What is regeneration? Give an example. Answer If a branch of a tree is broken or damaged, new branch grows in its place. This is called regeneration. For example, if a starfish loses an arm, new arm is grown. 2. Explain the movement in animals. Answer. Big animals walk or run on their legs. Birds and some insects fly with the help of wings. Boat shaped body and fins help the fish to swim in water. Animals like leech, snake and earthworm move with the help of muscles. Snakes have scales on underside of the body that help in motion. 3. How do aquatic animals breathe? Answer. Water animals like fish breathe through gills. Water enters in through the mouth and passes out through the gills. Gills absorb oxygen from water and give out carbon dioxide into water. 4. What is a stimulus? What is a response? 
Give examples. Answer. Anything that causes a response in a living being is called stimulus. Reaction of a living being to a stimulus is called response. Example A. A girl closes her eyes when light falls on her face. B. When the leaves of a plant touch me not is touched, it folds its leaves. 5. What is reproduction? Answer. The process of producing its own kind is called reproduction. Two, fill in the blanks. Conceptual understanding. Three, write T for true or F for false statements. Conceptual understanding. Four. Do you know? One fifth of the oxygen we breathe in is used up by the cells in the brain. The human heart stops one sixth of a second between beats. Five. Project work. Ask the students to make a list of stimuli to which we respond and stick it. In their project book. Note: Teachers are requested to ask the students to maintain a project book 